What is up everybody? This is the Ward Face, and today we are playing some more Assassin's Creed 3. I kind of just ended the last episode right in the middle of a cutscene, but it was getting long and I didn't know how long the next sections are going to be, so I don't know, we're just going to start it right up again. I'm recording this right after I just recorded the last one. I'm having a lot of fun with this game right now. Uh, let's go. Hatham just kind of like boarded the ship and I don't know what's going down. Where's this guy going? I'm sorry! Oh, you're not going anywhere, sir. How my people out? Oh, I can't use... Oh! Oh, you're screwed. Nice! Those officers were oddly easy to take down. You told me I didn't have a kill streak of three that entire time? Okay, whatever. Oh my god! I look like a... Crazy murder. What has Church done with the cargo? I'm afraid. Oh, <laughs> you see that rat <laughs> that ran straight to me? What? Do you see that? I'm now in the top 50% in the world and ships destroyed. What? Oh! Oh my god, Hatham, stop! Oh! Hatham is insane! We came here for a reason. Different reasons, it seems. My god, what did that guy do to him? It's like good good cop, bad cop. Where are the supplies you stole? <laughs> Come on, you can tell me. Oh, never mind. Not good cop, bad cop. Bad cop, bad cop. <laughs> Jeez. I ask again. Where are the supplies? <laughs> On the island beyond. Can't hate them. Keep punching me. <laughs> oh, no it. It it's not yours either. No, not mine. Those supplies are meant for men and women who believe in something bigger than themselves. Can I keep this uniform on Connor? From tyranny such as yours. I like this. <laughs> Are these the same men and women who fight with muskets forged from British Yes. Feet, who bind their wounds with bandages sewn by British hands. Uh, yes. How convenient. It is kind of convenient. We do the work. They reap the rewards. You spin a story to excuse your crimes. As though you're the innocent one and they See, the more and more people I start killing, the less I care when they die. Like, this guy's a douche! There is no single path through life that's right and fair and does no harm. Do you truly think the crown has no cause? Yeah, well, uh, I don't know. Right. I mean, they obviously you want something. You should know better than this. Dedicated as you are to fighting Templars. Templars. Who themselves see their work. Think of that the next time you insist your work alone befits the greater good. What? Your enemy would beg to differ. Yeah, well, that's kind of obvious. And would not be. It's not like the enemy goes, oh yeah, no, wait, we want the exact same things that you want. That's why we're going to start killing you. No. I mean, it's obvious that they think they're right. Why did he stop like that? Is he like... Leaning against the wall. Well, this passing was the wrong for us both. Come on. I expect you want my help retrieving everything from the island. 
Oh yeah, it looks like he was against the wall. <laughs> oh, look. I almost did half of the synchronization things right. <laughs> Memory nine synced. Nice. What's going on? I have been oh, there we go. I was about to say, why isn't he talking? I know if this bodes well or ill. Our goals are aligned, at least so far as independence is concerned. I like that outfit. But he continues to defend Charles Lee. The man who murdered my mother and burned my Look village. at that. Pretty cool. Still, he makes a point about Washington. No! Don't start saying that. I hear much talk of freedom and equality. But it seems one must be a left-handed white man to benefit. What of someone like me? Or Surrey? What role for us in this... Stop movie? doubting! That's what he's trying to do. Is my father right then? No. There is so much I must consider. Achilles! Time in which to oh, I never realized that eagle thing. Achilles! Gonna. Welcome back. And how was Martinique? Achilles, I. I owe you an apology. Aww. It was wrong of me to say the things Aww. I did. Oh, I never realized that cool assassin thing on the belt. But there was also truth there. I feel of course it's not showing it because that lantern's in the way. But now their hold is weakened, which makes me believe there's a chance for peace. Oh. Imagine what might be accomplished if we were to unite. Why the change of heart? Where is this coming from? Achilles is suspicious. You've met your father. Oh. I do not claim to trust the man or even like him. But I would be remiss to ignore this opportunity. Oh. Achilles isn't happy if with this. He may listen, but will he understand? And even if he does, will he agree? Even he must admit that we can achieve more together than we do alone. I assume you're off to find him. Achilles doesn't like this. Yes. I ride for New York to see what might be done. I wish you could play as Achilles. That would be awesome. Why couldn't Achilles be, uh... I mean, I love Connor and everything. Don't get me wrong, but... I wish I could... Like, if Achilles was related to Desmond, that would be awesome. Um, I really don't want to ride to New... Oh, oh my god. So, uh, okay. Oh my god, I it didn't like let me fast travel at first. That scared me. Like, I'm not gonna ride there. I'll just throw away my game if I had to ride all the way to New York on a horse. Oh, I hate horses. The more and more I look at this New York thing, this uniform, the more I like it. Okay, everybody, so I probably cut that last section out. This place was a lot farther away from where I originally fast traveled to, so uh, we got here, though. It's just like five minutes of running across New York, though, so here we go. I wish there was more fast travel points, like, all around. Well, there probably is. I'm just, once again, probably doing something wrong. It was daytime when I walked over here. But the soldiers themselves are told nothing now, only to await orders from above. Keep digging. Come find me when you have something worth sharing. Yes, sir. So you gave me a friendly head nod. I like that guy. If this attacks him, we'll be able to put an end to the civil war and be rid of the crowd. What do you intend? Well, nothing at the moment, since we're completely in the dark. I thought the Templars had eyes and ears everywhere. Oh, we did. Until you started cutting them off. <laughs> we did kill like four of them. It tells us Sorry. Exactly Track down the loyalist commanders. <laughs> that sucks. They were like Haytham's friends. <laughs> oh, we kind of just like killed like ten of them. No big deal. 
to the officers meeting. Hey, Thumb. How come Haytham can run straight by the guard dogs? Oh, jump. Oh, you did. That wasn't really a leap of faith needed moment. Let's go, Haytham. Like father, like son. Oh. What are you doing, Connor? Connor, we're losing him. Oh, stop it. I love climbing. <laughs> I don't know why. I can just like climb for like 25 straight minutes, like doing these kind of things. I'd be fine with that. They should just make full climbing missions. Hello. Did we do it? Yes. I don't want to fight them. This is going to be a hard battle. <laughs> Have you considered the proposal? I'm unconvinced. To reinforce them would leave New York exposed. It's hard enough maintaining order with our current numbers. Cut in half. Yet if we do not join with them, they risk defeat. And then what? Well, they should have come by sea. Talking in circles. Well, nothing watching as we are. Then what do you propose we do? March in there and demand Kill them. Answers? Yes. Well, yes. Ambush! Oh! Connor? Little help here? How about no? You know. Leave the commanders alive, Connor. We can interrogate them. Come on. Attack me. Come on, somebody attack me, please. Ah. Oh. oh, that guy's punching me. Are you kidding me? Oh, nice try, sir. Big guys. Nope. Oh, I'm sorry. Now that I know about the like human shields, that's one of my favorite things. Come on. Boom, 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 boom. <laughs> There's three of them there. How would you want to bet Hathen kills them or something? George and see what secrets they might share. Really? Well, you best get after him then. You go. I will watch the prisoners. No, you do it. Why me? Because I said so. Now go. <laughs> No! Wow! Don't listen to your dad! Gotcha. Now can I kill him? Move. Go to hell. I said move. You're doing this in the middle of the street, sir. <laughs> I don't know. Wait, wait. I'll tell you anything you want. Anything. Only don't. We just have some there. questions for you. Cross that threshold. I'm a dead man. There you are, Connor. I was worried you might have gotten lost. 
Come on, Ben. Uh oh. He's not making it out alive. Haytham is like crazy. He just kills everybody. Come on. Move. 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 Go. Keep him on. I don't trust Haytham. Keep going. Where are you going? Stop it. Keep walking. <laughs> I feel mean. This guy's just doing his job. What's that on his pouch? Oh, I thought it was the assassin's symbol. Can I just like angrily push him constantly? <laughs> I feel bad. But I can't stop doing it. What happens if you don't push them? Go! This does not look good. What are the British planning? To march from Philadelphia. That city's finished. New York's the key. They'll double our lines. Push back the rebels. When do they begin? Two days from now. June 18th. I must warn Washington. You see? That wasn't so very difficult now, was it? I I've told you everything. Now let me don't. go. Don't. Of course. Hate them. Don't do it. Hate them! The other two said the same. It must be true. You killed him. You killed all of them. Why? They'd have warned the lawyers. Come on. Tell them until the fight was done. What? They waste precious time and money on their care. What would be the point? They'd given up everything they knew. Stop it, Hazel. I'll meet you at Valley Forge. I don't. I don't want to work with Hazel anymore. This is getting ridiculous. All we do is kill people. I don't like it. Where are we going? Ah. Uh, that like hurts me inside. What? So, oh, I have one. No, you didn't see me. It's enough. Ah. I'm gonna find a sign. Oh, uh, no, you didn't. Stop. Stop. No, I'm not. I'm not the one they sent. <laughs> I'm sorry. You got the wrong guy. Let us find a poster. Any posters around? Anything? I'm a wanted man. Gotta put up one of those posters. No posters? Come on, this is getting ridiculous. No, you. What? That makes no sense. Oh! <laughs> Stop. There really isn't any posters up in New York, is there? Oh, I should have climbed that. But... Oh, I did. Oh, so much running. Okay. Come on, they should take one. Like, they should make me incognito just for listening to the guy. He said, get down. What did I do? I got down. Gotta respect your authority. Okay. I'm glad we just... We just spent an entire episode running around. Okay, everybody, I probably sound different than this, but uh, I just went back to edit all this. This is I'm actually not doing this live, but uh, I went to edit the video, and I just realized that uh, for some reason the last like cutscene it skipped about ten seconds of it. Uh, you'll see it in about five seconds. It's just really weird. I don't know why I did it. So. Uh, 
I mean, I'm glad it happened at the end of the video. I'm not going to talk over the cutscene. But uh, that's all I really wanted to tell you. So, there's a weird skip, but you don't really miss anything. It's pretty much Haytham finds a letter from George Washington telling him that uh, he is going to order atta an attack on my village back at the like Indian tribe thing. Um, I'll let the cutscene play before I keep talking. Allied natives working with the British. I've asked my men to put a stop to it. By burning their villages and salting the land, by calling for their extermination, according to this letter. Not the first time, either. Tell them what you did 14 years ago. That was another time. The Seven Years' War. And so now you see what happens to this great man when under duress. He makes excuses, displaces blame, does a great many things, in fact, except take responsibility. <laughs> I love that Who part. Who did what and why must wait. My people come first. Then let's be off. No. You and I are finished. Son. <laughs> you think love how Haytham tries to play like the if good I guy role. Son, I might change my mind. Connor just shoots how him right down. Sit on this information, or am I to believe you discovered it now? My mother's blood may stain another's hands, but Charles Lee is no less a monster, and all he does, he does by your command. A warning to you both. Choose to follow me or oppose me, and I will kill you. Okay, so Connor is officially a badass at this point. Um, that's the end of this video. I might actually put something at the end just because it looks like, because of all like the editing for me running around, that uh, the video is actually a little shorter. I did have like an epic wolf fight in the middle, so I might stick that at the end. Um, it's probably not going to have any talking over it, but I mean, that's all that I have for this video. Uh, make sure if you liked or didn't like it, tell me why, and subscribe if you want to see more videos. I'd like to put at least one out a day. Uh, that's all I have to say about this video. Have a nice day. Goodbye. <laughs> Sorry about the weird episode and all the skippings. Okay, everybody, here's the wolf fight. Um, I didn't really think it was enough to, I don't know, like, interrupt the running through the woods, but I thought I'd add it at the end as a little bonus clip, because this episode is a little shorter than my, uh, most of my other ones, so. Uh, right before this, actually, about a minute, I walked up, and I saw three guards, two of them attacked me, and then the third one was actually being attacked by a wolf, and I knew I was getting into something bad. And then these few wolves attack me, and, uh, what was actually good is because I, uh, like, got all those skins and stuff, I'm gonna go and use that money that I got from all those to prop, uh, probably buy a few more outfits, so that might be good. And then I run into this next batch of wolves, and I don't know, just whatever this region is, there's just hundreds of wolves that don't like Connor, and, uh, maybe it's my new black, uh, the suit. Oh, this one actually gets me. It's the only one that was able to attack me, but I don't know, maybe they would have liked it better if I had the Charleston outfit on or whatever, but I don't know. I just thought this was funny because I got attacked by so many wolves. I didn't know what was going on. Um, but like I said, uh, this has been a kind of a weird episode. And what's crazy is this is episode 20. I can't believe I'm already at episode 20 of a series. It's insane, but, uh, hopefully there's 20 more. Uh, I don't know if the game's gonna go that long, but you know what I mean. Uh, that's all I'm, that's gonna be in this episode once again. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and I'll see you next time.